Hello and welcome to episode 28 of our Silver Run 4 series. Uh, just a little recap, if you remember from the last episode, we did replant this grass field on the, on the right here with trees. Um, and we did a bunch of locking. We kind of went along the road all the way to the far edge of the property. Uh, we got a lot of trees stacked up there still that we need to bring down. But uh, we went to head into town and grabbed our flatbed trailer so we can load up some of the logs. Uh, let me just see here. I need to switch this over to the correct pallet type. There we go, Euro pallet, and get these loaded up. Uh, so what we want to try and do is get as many logs as we can, load it up, and do a run over to the lumber mill to get these sold. Uh, the price, I believe, is pretty good right now. Uh, so let's hop in the uh, semi here and go grab some more logs because I want to try and get as many as we can. And while we're heading over there, because we're going to need this soon, I'm going to go ahead and use the follow me mod to get the Valtra to follow me up there to the area where we are currently logging. Okay, so we got this up here. Uh, let me just see where the... Oh, there's the Valtra. It was moving a little slower. Uh, so let's uh, park this over here for now. Kind of out of the way a little bit. So we are going to need it soon, I think, because we're going to start going down the hillside with our logging, which uh, the logging trailer doesn't work so well in that so we'll need to use the yarder to pull those up either up to here or down to the flatlands below All right, so let's get a load of logs and get this down to our wood factory All right, so we got the rest of the logs here. So let's get these unloaded and processed. I'm hoping it will give us a full load, but it may not. It'll be close, I think. Squeeze by here. All right, let's see. How close are we? It's going to be... Oh, so close oh my yeah oh yeah one pallet away one thousand liters away okay so let's head up here um we technically only need about <laughs> one tree and that would probably cover it but you're up here you got a trailer you might as well get a full load. Because why not? So, yeah, what's, uh... I guess we're going to start doing is just kind of start going down the hillside here a little bit. Because we're at the edge of the property, so let's just kind of work our way down a little bit and get a pile of logs here that will be close to a full load. And... Yeah, that way we'll have... 
enough for you know to take it to the, to uh, the sale point, and we'll have some surplus left over for the next time, or for the paper factory, one or the other. But yeah, so let's get these trees down. Start with this really big one here. This is a big boy. Oh, don't tip over the harvester. Don't. Oh, oh, oh nope, 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 nope. Nope. Swing it back over. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to tip it over because I am leasing it. I haven't bought it yet. So they wouldn't be too happy with me. All right. All right, so we've cut down a few trees. Got another big boy here. This should give us a nice... Uh, wow, three. Let's give us four. Wow, four and a little change. That was a big tree. That's pretty impressive. All right, so I think that's enough wood. That will keep us, well, to definitely fill the trailer and give us a nice little uh, surplus for the next time. So let's hop in the semi and get this loaded up and back down to our uh, wood processing factory. So we got the rest of the trees all loaded up here. A little bit some bad stacking, but hey, I got it all here. Just uh, back it up a little bit. All right. Is that off? So we have a full load now, which is good. And let's see how much we have in surplus. So 20,000 plus so those three. So almost 20, 23,000 liters left over, which is awesome. So let's uh, take this down to the sell point and get it sold. And get that money. All right, let's uh, pull in here and get this sold. Get some of that good money. Wow, 202000 Why am I not doing this more frequently? It's some good money there. Yeah. Huh. Um, anyways, we need to head down to our farmland because we have a couple of things we need to take care of. Alright, so the major thing I need to get done here is we need to get our environmental score up. Um, no, actually, before we get on that, let's check the fermenter dryer because I. Yeah, we're getting a low, low on grass. We're turning through it pretty fast. So we have some hay in here plus more. So let's turn on silage. Turn off hay because we want to get some silage. Um, it's primarily for making TMR. We're not going to be making any yet because the cows are too young. There's no benefit to giving them TMR yet. So we're giving them hay. Um, but it'd be good to have it some ready for when they get older. All right. So let's uh, drop the weight here. Then we're going to head over to here, the other shed, and grab the sprayer. Uh, now, one of the things we want to do here is. Um, Give the the fields a quick spray. Uh, oh boy, that's the wrong. 
I, I yeah boy. I uh, was gonna grab the uh, forage wagon and try and spray the fields with that. <laughs> so let's try it with an actual sprayer. Uh, but what we want to do is give the the fields a quick spray uh, with herbicide. It's actually not gonna use any because there's no actual weeds yet. Um, but even though I have weeds turned on, there's none in the fields. But we need to spray them to get the bonus. It's not going to use any herbicide, but it's just the act of actually doing it is what the game requires. Um, now next season we'll have to actually use herbicide. But if we go in here and look, uh, let me get down here. So our our score here went up after the weed control. Uh, the nitrogen won't go up until after harvest because nitrogen and pH is not reflected until after you harvest the crop on the field. All right, so let's get the barley field done and then our other grass field down here. And then I'm going to head up to our other property in the forest and do that grass field as well because we want to get all the bonuses we can to get more money when we sell stuff. Okay, so that should be enough for all three fields. Yes, we got it there. We got it there. Uh, let's check this one. And yes, we got it here too. Um, so this one does not have it yet. So we'll need to head up here and do that field as well. Um, as you can see here, the environment with the score is increasing our sell prices by 5%. Uh, we can get a much higher than that. So we'll need to head up here and do this field as well. And the uh, nitrogen and pH on that one will update once we, next time we mow the grass. So I need, I'll need to mow the grass. I hope I left enough space between the trees I planted to do that, but we'll find out soon, <laughs> soon enough. <laughs> All right, we are back here just getting some of the pals loaded up and let's see how much we have. I think we're gonna do some logging. The, there's a worker driving the class up here with the sprayer, but we're gonna do some logging first. Uh, let's see how much we got. Um, oh, exactly one third of a trailer. All right, so yeah, let's hop in the semi. We're gonna head up here. I'll do a jump cut scene there, and because we're going down the hill, this means we will probably use the yard to get some of these logs up. But yeah, so let's head up here and get some trees. I go straight from the bank, gassing up the tank, cranking up the radio, playing old Hank. It ain't that long. Tell them back at the pond. I'm pulling up the truck down at the dock. It's time to do some cruising, baby. Get a little stuck. It's a Saturday joy ride. First and feast is the spot. To take the blues away. We're on a boat. We're feeling fine. All right, so we have a pretty good pile of logs here. Uh, so thing we're gonna do is uh, we'll pull the tree harvester up here out of the way and then go hop in the Valtra and use the yarder to pull these logs up to the top of the hill. All right, so let's pull up right about here. I'm going to drop the yarder. Oh, that's the weight. That's the yarder. 
drop it down because that little shelf kind of acts as a little uh, extra break. We'll grab the cable and get these uh, logs hooked up and pull them up to the top of the hill. So I got the rest of the logs pulled up here. So let's uh, get here and just get lined up and get all these loaded up. think this will be a full load but it'll be close oh oh don't tip don't tip don't tip uh, okay i probably should look into see if there's a more stable trailer than this one because this seems it's seems to tip over pretty easily even with that many axles on it um but let's see how close we are to being a full I'm hoping, but I don't think we will fill it up. No, I didn't. Darn. But I think we're going to go ahead and sell what we have. Um, but first, I think, let think about this. Yeah, so first, uh, let's hop in the class tractor here and get this sprayed. So we can get that done with and um, get that filled bonus. All right, so we got that field all sprayed. So let's send this back down to a uh, main farm uh, wash point. I need to add another waypoint for the shed there. Um, but yeah, so that will give us a much better environmental score, which is going to bring a little bonus when we're selling our wood now, which helps. I think it's looking like a 5% bonus right now, but you know, Two hundred thousand dollars, you know, five percent, like ten thousand dollars. That adds up. Adds up fast. Uh, so let's take this down and get it sold. I right, have a full load here, so I'm thinking we'll probably hit around a hundred and. 50, 160 ish around there. 104. Why so low? We got our environmental score reward, which is great, but why so low? Was there a great demand when I sold it last time? And I just didn't realize it. Yeah, because the price is going. There must have been a great demand. Oh man, that's, oh boy. If I'd known that, I would have uh, kept doing some more logging and sold trees <laughs> faster. 
All right, so uh, we're almost out of gas. So what I'm gonna do is take the trailer back up to our land and then head to town to get some gas. All right, so let's uh, pull in here, refill up because we are getting low. And I think while we're here, I'm gonna go ahead, this thing has a reservoir for refilling tractors and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill up that tank as well, just so we have it. And this might be expensive. So that was very expensive. Um, oh, oh, what? I, I wasn't speeding. I'm not speeding. What the heck is going on? Let me just pull over and find out what's going on here. Oh boy, 